Good morning, Hank. It's Monday. Oh, hold on. I feel like I might need to uh, grow a mustache. Oh, God, it's terrible. Somehow it's worse because it's subtle. But anyway, it's pizza the most magical time of the year here in Nerdfighteria, where for two weeks we make week daily videos just like it's 2007 all over again. I don't like to brag, but I think my mustache that inspired pizza was the very first mustache not to know whether it was ironic, which is now like a widespread phenomenon. I can't explain the whole backstory of pizza. Hank made a video about it once, but every year during Pizzamas, DFTBA.com commissions lots of stuff on the theme of my mustachioed face, which is only available during Pizzamas, and today I'm gonna unbox all that stuff. I don't know what any of it is. Okay, oh, there it is. Oh boy. All right, let's get started with this beautiful Pizza John mug. If you want to drink your coffee in a way that's classy and sophisticated and just slightly mustachioed. Then we have this magnificently subtle Pizza John sweatshirt. It's a football scarf but for Pizza John. <laughs> it's actually a surprisingly comfortable scarf. This is, really is shaping up to be the best pizza miss ever. At this point, the Pizza John shirts are like high art. I mean, look at this. Me as a badass pizza delivery driver. I mean, this is magnificent. Oh my gosh, I have to put it on now. Then we have this amazing brickhead me pizza. I've always wanted to be a brickhead. I mean, look at this. It's just a beautiful deconstructed pizza with my face on it. You're not even gonna feel weird wearing this shirt. You're gonna feel awesome. And then lastly, <laughs> but certainly not least, it's none pizza with left John. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, <laughs> nothing in 2019 has made me as happy as none pizza with left John. I love it all so much! Pizza Miss is so beautiful and stupid! There's also a great sticker collection in case you're looking to adorn your phone or your laptop or any other surface with my mustachioed face. Did we finally make a bandana? Oh, we did. Look at this bandana! I gotta do it. I, I feel like it's an obligation. When I was at summer camp, I learned how to tie a bandana. Now, this was 30 years ago, but I bet I can still do it. Everything about this look is excellent, but what's best about it is uh, this fella. I gotta put on the shirt where I'm on the Vespa. These shirts are amazing. All of this is available only during Pizzamas at DFTBA.com. Go right now, DFTBA.com. False sense of urgency. Now that our profits go to charity, I've become a much harder seller. We have more stuff. Shut the front door. It's a Pizzamas underground map in which all the stations are different kinds of pizza. And lastly, we have two pins. You can choose between one that says pineapple pizza forever and one that has a pineapple with a line through it and says, nope. I guess whichever of those pins sell more will then be declared the collective opinion of Nerdfighteria in re-pineapple on pizza. It really is the best pizza miss yet, thanks to everybody at DFTBA and all the amazing designers who participated in this weird project. You can go to DFTBA.com to get your pizza miss stuff now and- Wait, I forgot two important things. Fortunately, I haven't shaved my mustache. First, we've got this Pizza John pennant so you can brag about having gone to pizza college. And secondly, Sarah and I have been making watercolor paintings together. I know, it's, it, it's so stinking cute. And we're making just a few of these watercolors in the shape of pizza slices, which we're calling Mystic Pizza by John and Sarah. So yeah, a few of these are also available. I think that's it. Happy Pizza Miss! Hank, I will see you tomorrow!